talked about James Randi and him uh, taking the homeopathic pills, you know, the sleeping pills, and supposedly overdosing, eating all the whole bottle of who knows how many, and nothing happening to him. And of course, it's true that homeopathic companies, probably many of them, are fraudulent. And they basically take advantage of your fear of side effects from uh, pharmaceutical products. But there is uh, natural healing. There is uh, plant-based remedies. Uh, it is there. But the, the, the thing is that just because something is advertised as such doesn't mean that it's actually effective. So we are always dealing with um, people, whenever you search for something and want something, you always have somebody there that's taking advantage of you wanting it. When you have um, sugar substitutes, for example, that are much worse than sugar for you, it's important to be level-headed here and make good decisions based on getting the right information from the right people. So I'm hoping that if any of you have any kind of information or advice, something that's um, worked for you and proven to work, and again, we are not doctors here, don't take any of my advice, you know, I need to tell you that. Uh, if you have problems, see your physician. But there are things that we can use to prevent something. I'm not telling you that if you need a surgery, just eat some plants. No, of course, there are times when you have to be very, very happy that a doctor is around or available to you. But there are many, many things that we can do to be healthier. And it is absolutely amazing how unhealthy life really is. When you have the mercury and the tuna and all of these things, it's really alarming. And I'm always wondering, our life expectancy would probably be 120 years if it wasn't for all the poison that's happening in this world.